Hey guys, what's up and welcome back to another video. I hope you guys are doing great. As you may have already read the title, I am going to be doing some mini slime and squishy dares. But before we do get started, I want to give out a huge shout out to this week's notification squad. Thank you so much for your comments. And if you aren't part of the notification squad already, all you have to do is turn on your post notifications and leave me a comment down below with the hashtag notification squad to be featured in my next video. I hope you guys enjoy today's video. If you do enjoy it, be sure to give it a big thumbs up and also be sure to leave more mini slime and squishy dares in the comments down below. Also, I completely forgot but I did post a new video over on my main channel. So after you're done watching this video, go check it out. I will leave a link for it below. So the very first dare that I'm going to be doing, I have done before, but a lot of you guys were commenting that I should do this one in miniature version. And it is to cut up a squishy into cubes and mix it up with slime to kind of like make a squishy jelly cube slime. For this dare, I'm going to be using this mini mango squishy that I got from a Smushy Mushy blind bottle. This one was actually my favorite because it was the only like mini fruit squishy that I had. But yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and cut this into cubes. So I'm going to put the cubes aside and start making the slime. In a bowl, I added in two mini cups of clear glue. To give this some color, I'm going to add in some food coloring and look at my new mini spoon, you guys. I actually recently bought a bunch of new miniature things, which you guys will be eventually seeing in my videos, but the spoon is so cute. Anyway, I'm going to go ahead and activate the slime now. So the slime is pretty much done and now we are going to pop in the squishy cubes. Don't you guys think these little cubes look like carrot pieces or is it just me? And here is the jelly cube slime all completed. This next year that I'm going to be doing, I have been seeing comments for this for I would want to say like two to three months and I'm not even exaggerating it. And it is to make slime on top of my phone. So my current phone right now is the iPhone X. And I have been avoiding this dare for quite some time, but I'm gonna finally bite the bullet and get this one over with. It shouldn't be too bad because I'm gonna be making like mini slime. We are just going to jump right into this dare because I just wanted to get it over with. All I did for this slime was pour in two cups of mini glue. I also added in some green food coloring and then I went ahead and I activated the slime. When I was adding in the activator, I don't know why, for some reason, I thought it would like damage my phone. But once I was done, my phone was completely fine. Um, I could not see like any difference, which was amazing. So it wasn't that bad, but I still would never ever do this again. Here is the dare all completed. And for the final dare, I'm going to be recreating a dare that I did a couple of months ago. And in that dare, what I did was I put a bath bomb into a bathtub and then I also put a squishy inside. So we have our mini bath bomb and then we have this toe squishy and this is a handmade squishy. I made this little guy in one of my videos, I think last year, you guys may remember him. I ended up using this squishy because it was small enough. The rest of my squishies were too big. So anyway, this time around what I did is I actually glued the bath bomb 
to the squishy so instead of doing it like separately i just glued them both together and now in this little tupperware container i added in some water and i'm going to pop in the squishy by gluing the bath bomb and squishy together the squishy was like moving around while the bath bomb was dissolving which i thought was kind of cool But the aftermath was not pretty at all. The squishy was completely stained and I don't think there's any way I can fix it. And that is it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Also, if you would like to stick around for future videos like this one, then be sure to hit that subscribe button. Thank you so much for watching. I love you guys so much and I will see you in my next one.